the organic compounds except alkanes contain some structural feature which help us in classifying these compounds on the basis of reactivity yes these are called as the functional groups the functional groups are a group of atoms within the molecules which give the compound a characteristic chemical behavior so if i have to define what a functional group is can i say that it is a atom or a group of atoms that determines the characteristic properties of an organic compound so for example the simplest functional group that we have is a carbon double bond carbon and this class of functional group is called as alkenes so if i talk about our example the example is c double bond c and yes it would have two hydrogens so this is what is called as ethene and the double bond is a functional group over here now if i take one more example i have ethane which is ch3 single bond ch3 now this is a poison yes but let me replace or let me add one oxygen to one of the bonds between carbon and hydrogen so i get something like this which is ch3 ch2 oh now what is this yes this is now an alcohol this is called as ethanol and this is a slow poison how is it a slow poison yes this is the actual alcohol which people drink and it kills them slowly rather than killing them instantly so that is the difference that a functional group makes to a compound so the first functional group that we have is alcohols now the group for alcohol is oh the suffix would be all and the prefix over here would be hydroxy now how do we do the nomenclature for the nomenclature you would use word root then you will add ain ein or wine subtract e and add all so that would be your nomenclature so if i have the first example over here this would be methane but if i replace the h with oh this would become methanol now what should be the common name the common name over here becomes methyl alcohol so similarly if i take the second example the second example is a two carbon chain so that should be ethane but if i replace the h with oh it becomes ethanol and the common name becomes ethyl alcohol yes ethyl alcohol now let's take one more example three carbon very easy what should be the name it should be propane let me show you a twist so we'll take the first example over here and i'll replace the h with oh so what should be the name propanol and what should be the common name it should be propyl alcohol right if i do one modification to the same i re change the oh this becomes propen to all because oh is placed at the second carbon to keep learning with such engaging videos download byjuice the learning app today